What's going on, Quo Familia? It's your fearless leader, Flame Sword. In the month of May, it was a monumental month of Force Status Quo and myself. As you all seen, I've taken full control and leadership of my life, which has allowed Status Quo to start rolling. Is the best way I could explain it. You're looking good. Tan. You're looking good, man. So what's up with you, man? You got a you got a team playing here? So no, unfortunately, we missed it out. I would. It was uh, obviously all the teams were able to play in it. I wish it was. The last chance qualifiers. Oh yeah, this is over there. This is the end. No, I know. I'm not saying it's on you. Um, but we got what the 12th or 14th seeded team in that range. Um, I'm excited for them to come to the Optic Major and all that. Yeah. They remind me of the roster that I had when I was competing and all that stuff. Like I see the elements there, and, and uh, they got that family vibe. Like one of the players is actually here, and then I got my VR team here too. Um, they're all from Texas, the VR team. So I got them tickets to come out here and check out like an actual East sports event because they just they jumped into the world of vr and gaming and all that stuff so i was like hey come see like what esports and all yeah. this other stuff is like we have content coming out every monday and check the status we have top five clips dropping every saturday and starting at the beginning of every month we are doing a recap aka the status report with this being the first episode now in the month of may we did show you a deeper dive into the world of eva aka esports virtual arenas big shout out to holt aka rodrigo for killing it with the edits and making everything that I have visually in my head come alive. Wouldn't be able to do it without him, and I'm so thankful for him. Moving along, we also went over the game modes that you can participate if you do come out to Flower Mount, Texas to play EVA. In the month of June, we're looking to drop the weapons and maps, so you all are super familiar with everything around EVA. On top of that, we showed you the number one VR squad in North America, aka the Status Quo VR team. Big shout out to Raz. Auto, Biker Pie, and the homie GG Zachary. Now they did go through winner's bracket. Unfortunately, they did get DQ'd in game five for breaking one of the rules, which is no running. The team quickly regained, and in the next best of five, since we were the winners and teams are coming from the lower bracket, we quickly went to work and took them out with a 3-0 fashion to win the first tournament ran by EVA held in North America. That is cool with both points. They're charging it up fast. Slayers, down here. even if they get both, I don't know. Oh, if they can win this, Status Thank Quo you. is going to be your champion. More tournament action coming to you in June, so definitely keep an eye on the Status Quo and my own Twitter, Flame Sword, for all the info and details to come soon. On top of all the VR action, we brought you all back to HCS Charlotte for our first event of 2023. As mentioned in the Check the Status episode, it was a last minute team, and unfortunately, a little while after, Nestle did decide to retire, which ended up forcing Status Quo to find a completely new roster once again shout out to clay and persecute for taking third and sixth respectively at the hcs charlotte free-for-all but it's crunch time and we had to find a team we found a pretty good roster in king j iggy cherished and straight sick unfortunately as we stated in the check the status episode straight sick did lose the energy to continue competing in 4v4 halo infinite which made that we had to find one more player diagram stepped up to the plate and ever since, I've been getting 2010 status quo vibes all over again. Now, status quo didn't win in 2010, but it was a pinnacle point in our history, and basically, to me, what set up the future. Now, you can see this roster compete June 30th to July 2nd at the Optic Major, HCS Arlington. Super excited to bring my team into the land of the Green Wall. Hope to see many of you there. But best believe, we're looking to make a run. On top of all that good stuff, we had our top fives as mentioned in the beginning of the video. The first two were just raw clips, followed up with a video casted by Magic, and then also showcasing her amazing casting ability. Collect, recently dropped from Sentinels, picked up by Complexity, making a home here for himself, helping Complexity to break into the top 10. Reversal. Collect lines up the perfect kill. Now the plan is to have her and other Halo casters jump on two casts when we do have the Halo Top 5. Definitely looking for some VR casters to jump on the VR clips and just produce as much content as I possibly can for you all. I also have another video series idea, hopefully starting this Friday, June 9th, so be on the lookout for my lifestyle people. I think you're all going to really enjoy this one. And that is going to do it for the first ever status report. I hope you all enjoyed. I hope you all continue following along. I hope you subscribe to our YouTube. Follow Follow us on Instagram, follow our Twitter, and continue sharing and liking everything you see. Every like and share does help, so the more the better. As always, this is your boy Flamesword. I'll see y'all later.
Peace.